Hello, my friends. I got a video for you guys. I want to show you how to remove nail tips from your red iguana practice hand. Now, one has already fell off, but there's still a little bit of glue. So I am still going to put that in there. That way all the glue will come off. But I want to see how long it takes for the um, tips to come off. So I have here, uh, actually this one I ordered from Sparkle and Company, but it's a hand dish and this is what it looks like, if you guys can see this, but it has four or five slots that you just stick your hands down and you just kind of rest your hand right here, but underneath, and this is what helps it bring off um, any kinds of acrylic or gel polish instead of, you know, wrapping your hands but um i only put i put hot water or warm water what uh you don't want to put really really hot water because if it's too hot you know it'll burn so you want to put it like fairly on the hot side but enough to where you can stand it so i put hot water in there and the lid fastens down right here and right here and right here so i do have two of these I ordered this one from Sparkle and Company, but I also ordered one from AliExpress as well. And I will link uh, that down below for you guys so you can check it out. Um, now, usually when I soak my hands in these, it doesn't take any more than maybe 15 minutes, 20 minutes at the most. Depends on how much acrylic you have on, how much gel you got on. But anyways, you take your acetone, pure acetone. And you just pour it into the slots. And since I only have four fingers, I'm just going to do four slots here. And I'm going to see how well I can stick this in here like this. Let's see. So I'm just going to tilt this down and... Uh, hold it down in. I might have to take it off the clamp. So I'm just going to kind of stand it up because it is a little bit too long. So I'm just going to hold it underneath the acetone like this and see how long that it takes to come off. All right now, so it's been about seven minutes and I'm going to pull these up out of here and see what they look like. I'll put them on the, so this is what it looks like after seven minutes. And I'm just gonna take a nail wipe and I'm just going to wipe these off. Now you have to make sure that you get all this stuff off. And make sure that it's out from underneath the um, cuticles as well. This one's not fully off. The glue is off of this one. And then I have this one. Okay, I'm just gonna make sure they're all the way down in there. I'm gonna push them down just a little bit to make sure it gets all the way underneath the cuticle. Make sure you got a loop. Taking it off, and then we'll make sure I squeeze them a little bit to make sure I get all that out from underneath.
Okay, so that one's still stuck on there a little bit. So let's uh, also go for a few more minutes. Make sure the water's still warm. Don't want to make sure it's on your finger. and just kind of go around make sure that it's all out it's not going to hurt it as you can see it is a little bit still in there Be really gentle so that way you don't tear your hand. Just to get back down in there for a minute. I'm just going to And that right there is just glue. So, Alright, so let's go around the cuticles again. Make sure it's all out. So now I'm going to wipe off this last nail and put a little bit of acetone on it and I'm just going to wipe this off. Whatever you do, if you make sure that you're using poly gel, at least put a base coat down or something to where you can peel it off before you suck your nails off. So there it is, completely clean again, and it only took 10 minutes, 10 minutes to soak them off. And they did have um, a layer of um, poly gel on them, so they, it did soak off. So, alright, so um, thank you guys for watching, I hope you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up, and thank you guys, bye!